welcome back to my channel. And so the reason for this, it will, it will, it will, it will all play out. It will all play out. I'm, I'm trying to keep it all together right now. I'm really, when I say try, I'm trying with passion. I'm trying with my soul, my energy, my aura, my all in all, my Wakanda. I'm trying people, I'm really trying. But basically today I'm doing a fashion vlog of things that I bought from Esa. Uh, so, um, today we are doing a fashion haul of things I recently bought from ASOS, which includes denim. Denim people, denim. We are all about denim and pastel colors right now. Um, I say pastel colors because I'm wearing pastel colors, but the video, it's got some twang to it. Would you guys like some nuts? I'll be eating during this session just so you guys know, so don't think I'm rude or anything. Mm. Unsalted. Packages from ASOS. Mm. So let's get right into it. So I'm just gonna show you the pieces that I bought. I'm gonna list everything as I'm showing you what I'm wearing and also the link to where you can get these items. They'll be on the description box below. But just for information, if you have the ASOS app or if you don't, you need to get the ASOS app. It's easier to use the ASOS app because you can list everything you want in your favorites. Um, you can check when prices go down because it always tells you low price and it gives you the new price It tells you when things are low in stock So which means you need to hurry yourself and get that item because it's about to go So basically it's such a great company. They have varieties of clothes from different brands and um, they do sales Like you know if you get enough points you get like some VIP goodies like you're the first person to know when the, the latest trend is out You get special discounts you get you know next day delivery I mean you get so much from ASOS that's why I love it and I have it in my app that's why I do most of my shopping people that know me you know I do most of my shopping all my fashion hauls if you know one or two times I might have gone to Selfridges but because of these luxury items but normally every time I go shopping it's always with ASOS ASOS always got me covered however however I was watching Jackie Aina and I really don't know how she has the tolerance and the composure to do these fashion hauls i was watching her and like every time she seemed to order things because we I, I think we're the same type of build because like we're quite curvy but we're still not big ish if you know what i mean like i'm 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 big but i'm not big big you know big i'm big anyways i think we have the same kind of body sh body shape body shop um, so me and Jackie, we have the same type of body shape, I would guess, just looking at her vlog. I was watching her doing her funny fashion review um, of Fashion Nova. I mean, I love Jackie. Jackie, if you're watching, Jackie, 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 Jackie. is one of my all-time favorite YouTuber ever. Okay, ever. After Patricia Bright and Jamie and Nikki. But Jackie, oh my God, that's my girl. Like, you know, we kind of interconnected somehow. I don't know how, but like, there is a connection somehow and somewhere. I know that for a fact. I was watching her review on Fashion Nova and she has some really banging outfits. And I was like, I was so jealous because, like, the Fashion Nova, like, the fittings just seem to, like, really, like, fit people that are curvy. Um, I know, I know, I know, Pretty Little Things just started doing, like, a line for curvier people. I haven't tried out their, any of their things yet. I'm looking to do it in the future, but for now, I'm sticking with ASOS because I know ASOS. Um, ASOS as well, you can, because it's not just their own brands, they, they do different brands as well, so you kind of have to be really careful. Like, if you might be a 30 waist in jean with Levi, it doesn't mean necessarily with another company like Mill Suffishers that you'll be the same size. That's the kind of thing you have to be kind of careful about. So what I tend to do, I always tend to order two, like trousers normally I always order two pair like if I order like a size 12 I order size 14 because somehow somewhere something doesn't fit me so I always got the option to um, up for the bigger um, size I'm gonna show you the pieces I've got for this review this is a really really cute very simple white crop top and um, it's an ASOS brand ASOS brand that you can see here I really love this top. This top is so simple yet so effective. Like you can wear this with high waist jeans, you can wear this with a high waist skirt. Listen, if you got the stomach, you don't need a high waist anything. You can have low riders, you know, button crackers, anything. Like this is like the cutest thing and it's so cheap. And um, so I thought I want I wanted to get this. It was a gray as well, but the gray in size 12 was sold out, so I had to get the white one, but I love the white one. So the white one, you can wear literally anything. Like, you know, I'm I'm starting to get the stomach, to start showing stomach a little bit. 
just a little bit like I can show like this much of stomach right now um, but I'm still working on it if you guys follow me on my weight loss journey or here oh you know so you can just watch how things are going I'm gonna do a final review of how much weight I've lost but for now we're just sticking to the fashion girls sticking for the fashion top from ASOS um, I'll rate this a lovely 9 9 out of 10 definitely I mean this this top good ASOS When I used to live in Sweden, my top three shops were one, H&M, obviously it's Swedish, that's what everybody wears. And there's another Swedish brand called Olens, that was my second favorite shop. My third, which actually used to be my second, but then I kind of, uh, I don't know, I don't know. I was, I was very bland when I was younger, but I don't know, I found my inner unicorn when I grew up. Um, Vera Muda. Vera Moda, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, Vera Moda is my third favorite store in Sweden. Uh, I'm not really sure where the store is from, but I absolutely love their collection. Um, because we are doing denim, people, denim, all right. Um, I bought this denim shirt from Vera Moda. It's a size large um, with my white crop top that I bought from ASOS. Perfect, per imagine this crop top and a pair of jeans. Girl, you be slaying it, you be Slaying, okay, you can wear this crop top and jeans or a skirt. You can wear this with anything Um, so what I like to do with this You can either wear it as a full shirt or you can wear it off the shoulder and you can also have it like um, a low cost So basically you just unbutton the uh, buttons until it reaches like a modest area of your liking Um, so yeah, you can rock this any who you can rock it like girl I'll leave it up to you but me personally I will I could the two ways I would rock this is like fully button if you want to look smart if you want to get that little set of hair then you show that little shoulder Hi. so that's how I rock this very affordable it's very thin it's very thin so don't go thinking like you know it's February but um, London is like minus four right now so I wouldn't be going out with this on its own Probably throw a jacket on top of it, a fur jacket or a leather jacket. Girl, you still look good, okay? You still look, you can't go wrong with Bermuda. You cannot go wrong. Ooh. So guys, if you saw my last uh, Valentine's lookbook, you saw that I've got this really, really, really cool, like, um, denim jeans that were in black that had that um, suspender kind of look to it everybody's been asking me about this I mean on my Instagram picture everybody's like literally where did you get that from I'm getting messages like where did you buy that from how much was it where did you find that I'm like god I got you don't worry I'm a little bit thing you know I like to share you know like some people don't like to keep a spoon ones are a another version of those uh, suspender trousers so these ones they also got that little detail here so they've got two straps here and uh, at the back it's kind of like fully covered so basically it's just the front bit so you only see the thigh bit was my other ones it kind of went down longer so you have to go back to the other video to kind of have a look sorry that was a bird but basically this uh yeah I love these they fit so nicely normally I always have problems with jeans because of like my waist but these ones I think it's the diet as well I think my diet is actually working I'm kind of getting like my, my, my shape is kind of tightening up so I'm thinking um, it's really helping so these are size 30 32 um, I like jeans a lot I don't like crop jeans or ankle jeans like it's it's not really i mean on some people it looks so nice on me i just look stupid because i just look like I, I look like goofy or like steve urkel if anybody remembers steve urkel so seriously these ones i think these are going to be summer bangers this one with the white crop top can i get a hey you will look banging girl you will look banging trust me all right sis trust me I have got a checker skirt so checker skirt seem to be coming back you know you, you're gonna end up looking like the girl from Clueless but hey you know fashion comes and goes this is why I keep telling people listen if you have something that you were rocking three years ago and it was it's out of fashion right now 
save it, save it, save it. Because you don't know, this thing might be coming back around. I mean, look, remember that time, like, you know, khaki was in. That wasn't too long ago, and now it's all back. Like, ah, khaki, khaki, like, it's a new thing. Like, I've been having khakis, but it's like, now you just want to bring it back, like, bring it back, eh, bring it back, bring it back, eh. So, yeah, so, check the skirt. Um, really really cute. It's quite short for me um, on the website. It looked longer But again, that's that's the kind of illusion that you get from um, Buying things online because the other thing because I've got a big booty You know my booty tends to swallow up most of the material So it kind of like gets shorter at the back, which I don't really like um, I, it, it just looks tacky and I don't know, look very cheap. I don't like that look at all So unfortunately, I'll be returning this skirt, but it's really cute. I like the idea of it if it was longer, I would have kept it. But this short, yeah. You know, you get a little wind and then you got gone with the wind. Yep. I'm like, nah, I'm, you know, married life. I'm not about all that. I ain't about all that. <laughs> So my next item is a leather jacket. Um, I love leather jackets. Like I love, I've got two black leather jackets, which I'm trying to get rid of, so I might sell it online. But because they're black, you know, I, I love black. I've, I've got so many black bags, but I'm trying to like reach out different colors. Like I love pastel colors, like for clothes. But when it comes to bags, I normally get black, or even jackets is always black because I'm thinking, you know, I need it to match with everything. But sometimes you need to buy more than one item with, you know, with especially a range of colors because like if you have like say if you have like um, a green jumpsuit like you know you, it might be look nice with a red jacket or you know you have at least to have that option so what I've done today I've reached out to people I have not even got a black jacket but I even hit the camera I bought a bright yellow jacket bright do you see how yellow this jacket is like this is the this will even blind the Sun that's how yellow this jacket is but you know what I said I needed a change in my wardrobe and um, yeah so I'm gonna dash the other two black leather um, coats that I've got and I'm gonna swap it for this leather jacket and basically wear this or anything I wouldn't say now is the time of weather for this I will wait till like maybe March April actually let's push it to April let's just be safe like let's say April you still gonna need a scarf people because like you know England is kind of cold right now I don't know what's happening like December it was like 5 10 15 now all of a sudden we're dropping to minus degrees I'm like I don't have time for this like I really like my wardrobe is not accustomed to this kind of weather but anyway so the yellow um, biker jacket I'll be saving this for whenever it gets warmer right now it is not time for me to wear this jacket but I thought because you know I didn't want it to you know sell out because I'm always late with fashion like I seem to be really late with fashion lately so I'm trying to keep up people I'm really really trying this is really hard but I'm trying you know working full-time having you know other businesses going on and trying to do the vlogging thing it's actually hard you know trying to find time and like this I didn't like two hours ago I didn't look like this but trust me this was not here this, this this was this was on on hold for someone's birthday or like a surprise dinner out somewhere this was not intended for today but anyways i did this for you guys because you know I, I ain't the prettiest thing to look at without all this so i'm not saying I'm, I'm 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 bomb but i'm saying it's an improvement this is an improvement trust me this is an improvement <laughs> I need to tell you the truth to be honest so this wasn't really like I, I'm cheeky sometimes I'm really cheeky like this wasn't really intended for me this is actually my husband's but I just you know because it was like I had a, like a denim feel and um, it, it's really cute guys so what I've done with this jacket this jacket yeah it's a um, I don't even know if it's gonna be mad if I actually tell you what size it is. But you know, it, 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 it's, it's, a, it's a style, it's a style. So this is from Le Coeur and Proper. I've bought items from them before. They're a really cool brand. You need to check them out. They're also on ASOS. Um, so this is a um, big, <laughs> big, <laughs> when I say big, it's big old. <laughs> sorry, babe, sorry. No, but seriously, this is like a triple, triple XL, like, 
this is triple xl people the thing is i just wanted a, like an oversized jacket kind of feel so i i put this on and i kind of just matched it with like the the white top and like the skirt it looks cute like i don't know if i you know he's gonna like he's probably gonna see this video like what the hell like this is this is what you do you say you buy me things and then you try them on and put them on youtube like you know but yeah, i'm sorry but anyway so it's really cute so basically um oversized jackets are in anyway so if you didn't like this jacket after this video i'll just keep it i don't think it's in the men's section if anyone's interested it's in the men's section so just you know type in denim jeans jacket i mean it's, it's really cute y you guys just let me know what you think here so what it happened was so I thought I heard something so what happened was um ASOS got half sizes um I've got big feet people I've got massive feet um so basically I'm an eight and a half I can get away with eight wide fit from new look but it's kind of a give and take kind of thing I bought these beautiful brown shoes I mean, look at these coach. Shoes. I, how gorgeous are these shoes? I really, really love these shoes. Like, I normally don't find shoes that I love like this, but these shoes are really like they are super gorgeous and they fit so nicely. I told my husband these are not walking shoes. This is like get me an Uber from A to B and let me walk for like two minutes before I need to sit down. These are not I like. I don't do heels, people. Like, I, I, my feet are so flat. I cannot stand in heels for much longer. So this is where the problem comes in. So when I went to um, open this package, I discovered, wait, actually, let me show you, because you look gonna think I'm lying, let me show you. When you find something online and you find it so cute and so affordable that you normally buy two of them in different colors, people, I selected different colors. The pictures were different colors, yet when they arrived, tell me, please, please, please tell me, why did ASOS think that I needed two of the same shoe? Like, why? Why would I need two of the same shoe? Can someone actually make sense of this? Like, why? Why am I getting two pairs of shoes that are exactly the same? Exactly. It's exactly the same, people. Exactly the same. So, wasting time. Actually wasting my time. I have to send one pair back and clearly write to you I asked for the beige one, you gave me two chocolate sh shoes, like I need one chocolate, one beige, you know what I mean? But still, you sent me two chocolate shoes, like how? Like you, you obviously saw my, listen, this is the bit when I, when, like the thing that frustrates me so much, like you know, I was really happy when the packet arrived and then this nonsense happens, it's just that it's such a waste of time and I'm doing this review thinking that you know I'm gonna have all my outfits, it's gonna look so cute. And then shit like this happened, and I'm sorry to swear. And things like this happened, and I'm like, what am I meant to do with this? Like, literally, now I have to wrap it back up, you know, fill in the form, send it back, wait for Lord knows how long, let them process it on their side, and then they have to figure out, or oh, if they even have it on stock by the time this shoe arrived back, and then send it back to me, how long do I have to wait for the shoe to come back? And I can't do another fashion review with one shoe. these vloggers do it i know there's some companies that are super 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 professional they make sure that whatever you order you get them if there's not in stock they refund you your money within like 24 hours and you get some companies so basically what happened was the other day i um i ordered this coat this coat was so beautiful and it was on like half price and i ordered it um they were they were good at taking my money they they withdrew it from my, from my account and then literally like four hours later i get this email saying that uh, apologies we don't have it in stock and yeah 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 
And you know, I'm thinking, okay, well, you know, my I'm gonna get my refund in in like a second or two, or maybe they haven't withdrawn my money yet. To my surprise, this is three days later, people, I still haven't got my money. They they took my money, and now they're holding my money hostage. Like, who does that? Like, what kind of company? And this is like a big, big respected company, and I'm I'm like really though like you if you knew that we was out of stock or like whoever's like taking care of like the the back end of your of your web page should be fired or whoever's doing the stock take should obviously be disciplined like hello like what is going on you need to always do the stock take and then update the website accordingly you can't tell me there is items when there's clearly not and now you're holding my money now i can't do things that i want to do with that money because you're holding it hostage until you got sort yourself out and then figure out that you know what she she actually didn't receive something anyways people i don't want to dwell too much on it but basically that was it you know what bothers me so much like you know when the youtubers actually get things sent to them you know they have the best experience but when they actually go to buy things like you know like the average joe things always go wrong like why would you portray that you're such a good company when you're sending free stuff oh yeah look at us look at us and obviously we as viewers we look at oh okay she bought you know she got sent that look everything went smoothly and then you fall for that trap and then you order as well and then you get this kind of bloody nonsense kind of customer service and you're like like what was the point like what is this like a scam is this what go is this what goes on you know what I mean? So that's why I'm like, I rate Patricia Bright for actually telling the truth how it is. You know, sometimes she orders stuff and, you know, she'll tell as it is. She, she will not sugarcoat anything. That's why I respect that girl. Because every time she orders, she'll tell you the truth. Like, it, it didn't come. You know, this is what happened. It was ribbed. It was smelly. It was this. It was that. You know, because obviously there was this other YouTuber that would lie through their teeth. And like, it was the best customer service. I had no problem. Because obviously they keep getting things for free. But you know, other real people like my girl Patricia, you know, she tell her as it is. You know, she tell her as it is. So you don't fall for that trap. But I'm telling you, LK Bennett, LK Bennett, if you didn't hear me, you lot, you need to change your, you need to change your policies or whatever, whatever rules that you've got going on. Saying that it, 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 and you can't refund me because it hasn't got 72 hours. Listen, you didn't give me the, the jacket for 72 hours. So why are you holding my money for 72 hours? That's what I don't understand. You guys need to get a grip. You actually need to get a grip and give them my money back. Like tomorrow, if I don't get my money back, wahala, you will, you lot will see a different review. You will see a different side to me today. Ehe. Don't forget to subscribe, people. We'll see you next week. Bye.